Michael, welcome to Rangers. It's been a slightly long and drawn out process, but you're happy to be here now? Oh yeah, just happy. It's finally over the lines, you see. It's been, it's been a long time. <coughs> I've not known where I'm really coming or going the last month, but just as I say, I'm delighted to be here now, yeah. Has the last month been quite difficult for yourself? Uh, yeah, obviously you hear a lot, of, a lot of speculation and a lot of things going on and you try to concentrate on playing football and <coughs> you hear the interest and my immediate action was you want to go to, to go in the big club and I'm just happy that this, the opportunity has finally came and it's happened, yeah. So. Do you think it might never happen? Uh, no, I think, yeah, uh, you've got, obviously that, there's a little bit of doubt in your mind, mm -hmm. you get a wee bit anxious, but I was confident I spoke to my, my family and my representatives and they, they assured me that, that that we'll get it done eventually and thankfully I just took to the last day but better, better late than never I suppose. You're going from Premiership to Championship, you did just mention there you want to go to the bigger club, do you feel this is a big step up for yourself? Oh massive, I think you see that when just yeah, everybody knows about Glasgow Rangers how big, big a football club they are and you see that I played there in early on the season, the, the crowd and the, the whole atmosphere, the, the pitch and, and obviously the way, the way the, the play as well, the manager I spoke to him and it's, it's just it's just the right, the right thing for me to do, it's the right fit and I'm just looking forward to it. So. What did Mark Warburton say when he spoke to you? I just spoke to him about how, how the boys, how we, they play and how, how, his ideas and mm -hmm. style of playing and it suits me, that's what I like to, as you see with what's 60-70% possession that they have for, yeah. for the games and that suits me, it's attacking attacking style and that's all I want to do is get the ball and, and go forward and attack and it's, it suits me to a T. So. When did you first hear of Rangers' interest in you? Uh, I think it was the beginning of was it the beginning of January. So I thought I heard there was a little bit. Obviously, you read stuff in the paper. I heard that a wee bit earlier on, but the initial was at the beginning of January, and I there was a chance. I was told there's a chance you might, you might move. And obviously, I wanted that was as soon as I knew that. I, I, my, that was my, my mind made up. I wanted to to go on and join the big club, and as I say, I'm obviously delighted. So. so it was an immediate decision that you wanted to come. There wasn't any. Doubt in your mind? Oh, no doubt at all. I think, as I say, it's, it's something you've got to grasp an opportunity that way with both hands, and, and there was no doubt whatsoever. I think. Why are Rangers the right club for you at this point in your career? Do you feel? I think uh, first and foremost it will help me become a bit a better player and a better. I think working under the, mm -hmm. the manager staff and working with the players here as well will help me progress as a as a football and, and help me move on and as I say I think they're doing, they're doing very well just now, I'd, I'd expect them to come back up but nothing's granted but I think that it's a team that's really, got, really going places so. You left England in 2013 is that right so yeah. were you aware of Mark Warburton the work he was doing at Brentford? Obviously yeah he was, I think he, they were doing well I think he got the promotion for League One didn't he so I think that they, I come up against Brentford a few times I was or for the young a young side that like to play to play football and that and that's a credit to, to Martin and that and then obviously they come up to the championship and they've done very well there, just missed out in the playoff final. So yeah, and I knew his style and how he wanted to, to play and then obviously he's, he's brought it here as well and the yeah. team's doing very well. So how does Mark Warburton's style kind of complement your style of play? As I say, they have got a lot of the ball and that's that's what I'm like to go on. and they're attacking and that's what I'm an attacking player and that's what I want to do, get the ball and, and, and go and go and have a go and that's it's just me that's it. Do you see yourself scoring a lot of goals in this team? Uh, yeah, I think uh, first and foremost I don't think it matters is, is scoring the goals as long as mm -hmm. as long as I win the game. I think you see the score the team is scoring that's a lot of the players are mm -hmm. throughout the team are scoring goals chipping, but I provided as well that's as a winger and that's what you try and do is provide the the, the forwards with the strikers with the goals but Obviously, I'd like to, to help chip in as well.